All right guys, doing a quick just handheld video for you guys today. This is for you guys with Hobie Links or if you have one on order. So this is a cool little mod for your paddle holder because the one that comes built in on the kayak is right here. It's just this bungee and it's terrible. And what I did is I took that and I just did my fish finder wires and then wrapped in there so that it keeps those fish finder wires nice and tight. That is not the mod I was talking about today. This is to replace that paddle holder. And I was just repurposing it in that mod. But this is what I went with, which is the Yak Attack double header with the Roto Grips. Um, and I'm gonna show you guys a few different options. So if you don't wanna buy this, there's some other options for you for a paddle holder. So I mounted, because I have A trails, which is the first thing. Uh, because I have A trails, I mounted the double header under the A trails on the stock track right here which doesn't take up any of your atrial room and it sits so flush and flat that it actually just sticks out and doesn't get in the way on the atrials. So you still get to use your atrials, you're not mounting it up here. It's mounted down here, locked in nice and otherwise unusable track because of the atrials. But because it's so flat and it sticks out like that, it works. Um, and you can do this on either side, whatever side you wanna hold your paddle on. And it comes with two roto grips. They also have a double header that holds a spike. So if you wanted to, you could do the same thing on the other side and have a spike on one side, paddle on the other, and then you have all your A trails still nice and free. Another option is to not do the double header and just take two roto grips and mount them on the tracks on your A trail, and that will work just fine. Your paddle would just pretty much take up your entire A trail. Or if you don't have A trails, the other thing you can do is take two roto grips and just use an entire track right here which if you're not fishing, uh, you probably don't have A-trails or if you wanna keep it simple. But uh, if, if you're keeping it simple or using this boat for recreation, you're probably not gonna have a fish finder. You're probably not using these tracks for a whole lot. So um, I would just get two roto grips, slop them in the factory tracks right there and you're good to go. You have a way better paddle holder than what you got right here with this bungee. This thing is really hard to get to because of the seat in the cup holder it's just not a good design that's what i would recommend as far as a paddle holder mod you got those three options you can mount the double header or you can mount two roto grips to the a trail or two roto grips to the factory track now because you can't drill in this boat you can't really mount paddle holders in too many places other than tracks i mean i guess if you didn't have a trails you could also take a screw and mount a roto grip to these holes and then there's one back here where the a trail goes into so technically you could do that that'd be a really wide uh, paddle holder you'd have to have a pretty long paddle and what i'm talking about with roto grips are just these things right here these are actually the ones for the spike i was running them on this side for my super stick but i wanted to show you guys these mod options especially for the lucky ones who have the hobie links and then there's a lot of you still waiting for your Hobie links. So you have those options. Uh, you don't even have to buy the A trails. You could still run a paddle on the factory tracks over there and your spike on this side. It'd be a super simple, you know, low profile uh, setup and you'd have an anchor spike and your uh, paddle nice and neat. But definitely do not use the factory paddle holder. Anyways, that's gonna do it for today's video on the Hobie links paddle holder. Stay tuned for more Hobie Lynx videos, kayak fishing videos, uh, Old Town Minn Kota 106 videos. As soon as this weather turns and it quits snowing, uh, which should be in the next couple weeks, I'll be putting out more content. And uh, hopefully you guys liked this video. If you did, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, and I'll see you in the next one.